The Centers for Disease Control has released an advisory about a potential enterovirus 71 outbreak that could show up in the coming months. This strain of the disease, also known as foot and mouth disease, can cause long-lasting neurological symptoms. As a precaution, the CDC is asking parents to pay more attention to their children's sanitary habits. Here we see children washing their hands with soap and water. Frequent hand washing is important as hotter weather marks Taiwan's transition to the peak period of enterovirus infection. Beginning in the middle of last year, we saw isolated cases of enterovirus 71. The CDC has also detected the spread of the virus in Taiwan. And with more cases of infection, there is the possibility of a potential outbreak. Enterovirus 71 was a dominant virus strain four years ago and could become widespread in May, with peak infection potentially in June. Doctors warn that among every 500 children affected with this strain of enterovirus, one child will have a severe case and could experience symptoms such as loss of coordination, hyperactivity, and respiratory problems. Enterovirus 71 attacks the brain stem, which controls our swallowing and breathing. Many of the severe enterovirus infections in children children will require nasogastric tube feeding for a period of time. According to the CDC, there have been 10 cases of enterovirus 71 this year, including two severe cases.